are you? Hungry? Mom's had a good chicken today, but you got shred chicken. Hi. Hi. Good morning. Here comes the creaky garage door. Old Faithful and Ruby, who's dirty, so it doesn't matter that the ground's wet and it's just going to rain today. All the kitties are here and they're doing good. Stripe is sort of behind me. He snuck into the house this morning and um, cleaned up whatever food nighttime didn't finish out of her bowl overnight. And then he wanted back out. He's got that let me in, let me out thing. Hey, Morris. Hey, Morris. Down pat pretty good. All right, you guys enjoy breakfast. I got all my miles, huh? Well, we almost messed up last night, yeah. left her outside and unplugged in because we I didn't end up going to Taekwondo. Yeah, we, uh, <coughs> you know, but we one of us caught. But it. I remembered. Yeah, but and did. I sent and I sent Dawn. <laughs> Hi, Donnie. Can you go pull Ruby in for me? <laughs> Hi, buddy. Good morning. Good morning, Mr. Man. Good morning. It's going to be a wet day, but you've got a dry spot. Goodness. Just a little excited? Just a little bit? Hi. There you are. Got his paper. Phew. All right, we're off. We're not starting out particularly late today. I'm being very gingerly on the boardwalk so I don't fall. Because I can't put on the shoes I would normally have on. Good morning, Ruby. Well, it's not really raining out here. David just a spit. Mostly stuff off the tires. Thank you. Yeah, this rider truck coming out of town. It's pretty slow and then I guess somebody else slows in the left lane too. We're having real trouble getting up to speed here this morning. But it is what it is. Woohoo! Johnny got out at 727. We're not late today. Yay! <laughs> it's uh, 58 out there. And I don't think we're going to have any substantial rain before 9 p.m. tonight. And say it might not sprinkle. I think there's a 10% chance of rain at 1 p.m. in the hourly forecast. And otherwise it's, it's zero. Although lately we've been having a lot of this not quite touch the ground stuff. So we'll see. I took down the gym, Pokemon Go gym at Cookout and um, put all our family accounts in it. Time to head on back down the road because uh, I'm losing the little bit of time I got back this morning from actually dropping Johnny off on time. I want to stop at Harris Teeter on the way through town and pick up a chicken for the kitties and some steaks for me and Don for dinner. Johnny will be headed to his father's house this weekend. Well, here goes nothing. If walking in and out of Harris Teeter goes okay, then maybe I can handle walking the South Park track a little bit. Don was able to take the bandage off my foot last night um, and put on a Band-Aid, and um, things seem to be okay, of course, um, tender. <laughs> I did okay in there, certainly enough to uh, go up to the South Park track and... Uh, walk around. I'd like to do at least four laps. That would be half the normal walk. I can't I can't miss two days in a row. It'll drive me insane. <laughs> there was a Model 3 that passed in front of me at the stoplight back there and the co-pilot was a doggy. <laughs> it was really cute. Wish I'd have been ready with the camera to catch it. The dash cam would be so far away you wouldn't be able to make out the pup. But um, very cute. And uh, steaks and chicken procured, plus a few other things. You know, I, I buy whatever deals I can get. You know, I go to three stores, and I look at the sales, and I try to pick up the things that we want at the store that has them the cheapest, the best that I can, without, you know, scouring ads, clipping coupons, and running all over town. Well, because we don't buy a lot of processed food or products, coupons are kind of... Uh, 
not really important to us, right? I mean, I don't need cereal coupons and I just, I don't need coupons pretty much. Um, and I guess with Amazon subscribe and save being the fourth place. Um, but you gotta stay sharp and you should definitely not assume that Walmart is the cheapest price on anything anymore. Those days are over. Even with Amazon having to ship it, they seem to be cheaper. Hi, are you happy? You could have put yourself in a in a softer spot if you'd wanted it. Stripe's been in here hanging out with us. I finished the video. We've tweeted. We're fixing to go for our walk. It's still warm at 64 out there. Do I know anyone that owns a red Ford Mustang Mach-E? If I do, hit me up at the Tesla meetup tomorrow. Um, show up with your car so we can see it. And um, it's yours. Harris Teeter this morning. Couldn't leave it there. Well, for starters, this line of cars is still parked up here. Inquiring minds really want to know what's going on with that. And no, it's not going to rain. I swear it's not going to rain. If there's more than two drops while we're out here on the track, I'll be surprised. Are you tweeting again? No. <laughs> so Don said he forbid me to wear my wig That's vest why. today. But he'd wear his anyway. I'd wear, yeah, I'd, pour, I'd wear it for both of us. I guess I let him get away with that today. I'm choosing to follow your suggestion. Although it wasn't presented as such. I was trying to describe to him that my foot basically feels like it suffered a trauma. It's not a burning pain or a jabbing pain or it doesn't feel like it, you know, after you get cut. It doesn't feel like that. It more feels like, um, you know, at one time I think I had a hairline fracture pretty close to where this uh, mole was in the upper part of my left foot toe area. And uh, it feels like that. Um, this time and last time. So I'm being pretty ginger with it. My gait is not normal. I'm just determined we're going around a few times because I'm stubborn like that. Yeah. And just to add to injury today, we've signed up to go give blood at 5.30. Yeah. Drop Johnny off at Taekwondo and then head over to Walmart to our favorite blood drive and donate blood. So, But I swear we're only going around four times. Normally I would want to do eight. Hopefully I can, I can swing that. Right now it's not going super great, but I've been sitting for a while. So let's, let's get limbered up a bit. Because that is the leg with the bad knee too. So not only is the foot not working right, but the knee's not working so good either. I'm not sure it was so good that Elon gave us permission to tweet <laughs> or post, post how we really feel on Twitter to have a community discussion about things. Because I can see me and or Don getting ourselves in trouble. <laughs> Oh, but I had somebody that I don't know like one of my tweets. Yay! <laughs> Yay. There's, there's rain on my Pokemon. <laughs> so Normally it shows the little rain. <laughs> it's un but there's real rain. <laughs> I swore it wasn't gonna rain. Yeah. It's my not gonna rain. Girl. It's not gonna rain much. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Let's go with that. <laughs> We're headed over here to pick up the four beer cans. We haven't seen a lot of other trash at the park today. We did such a good job yesterday. Yesterday. Um, so after two times around, it's feeling better, not worse. So that's good. My timing was perfect. It was. We hit the rain. Yep. <laughs> It'll probably be the only time today that it does rain, and we were out here in it. That's right. Yay! <sighs> Okay, that's six laps. When we went by for the start of the fifth, I kind of ignored that it was the fifth, so Don would, was talking so he wouldn't think about it. And then when we went by for the start of the sixth, I said one more. But I do need to debone the chicken for the kitties before I head back downtown, so I'm not gonna push for eight. It's really not a matter of what feels okay it's or what I can tolerate. It's because the answer to those are really, the bar is really high. <laughs> In other words, I'll drag myself around the track whether it feels okay or not. So no comment on how my foot feels right now. Following this red model three out of Fuquay, it's a, a newer car, it's all blacked out. And um, 
yeah we were caught up in some very slow moving congested traffic there for a bit and uh, he seems to need to get where he's going so I got out of his way fine with me thanks pickup truck wow Ruby's on autopilot and she didn't even hesitate there you know sometimes she's I wouldn't say that she throws you through the windshield anymore but sometimes she still breaks a little more abruptly than you'd want but I would say overall the cross traffic and her ability to calculate that the car is really moving out of her way in a timely fashion she they, the cars do much better now than they did a year ago with handling that not perfect every time but huge improvement on it anyway I'm listening to Kyle uh, he's got a video out about uh, Alyssa's uncle's 100s 2017 with a first he said 140 but a 130,000 miles and Kyle gave a nice shout out to me and Don and Ruby and our channel which is always much appreciated and um, it's good content so you should go check that out and I agree with him that the 2017 vehicles are really solid um, so it's good to hear Kyle talking so enthusiastically I mean I remember him in his s uh, you know traveling around coming to meetups having fun going to the track I, I remember that car prior to the three so those were good times really good times I'm done listening to Kyle's video now and he pretty much confirmed what I already knew. The 2017 vehicles are really great and um, there's no additional inspiration for me to want to really upgrade the um, software update stuff. Uh, anything really would be so short-lived that um, I just don't see it for, for us. Um, so that was that was a fun video to watch always enjoy quote unquote spending a few minutes with kyle and um yeah he mentioned the alcantara which i didn't mention in my five reasons why i wouldn't want to upgrade but i actually do really like the alcantara and uh all the places that it is on ruby which is the roof and the uh, dashboard so i could have added that to the five reasons i don't want to upgrade uh, list. You have been busy while I was gone bringing Johnny home. <laughs> I think I'll have a piece of that. You know I'm going to give blood and everything. Okay. I deserve it, right? This is, is this a help you give blood? Okay, good. Thanks, Donnie. You're welcome. Yeah, Ruby's got to be ready for the meetup tomorrow. Bye. Hope all you other guys are out there, either with a plan for this afternoon or tomorrow morning. But you can still come even if your car's not squeaky clean. We'll understand. It smells good. Is that bubble gum you said? Yeah, that's wow. I may almost make a person want to wash the car. It yeah, smells so good. It. I'll take a bowl of it, please. <laughs> Are you helping? That's midnight. Uh, had two different orders of Legos come today. And um, this is the stuff for the stair steps and some of the barrels and some of the flat green pieces I was missing. Nothing like boom, 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 boom. Test, 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 test. That's my kind of afternoon, God, Donnie. I don't know how you do it. If I had these works this hard, <laughs> I just can't do it. Uh, so the cable to the scanner machine is bad. We That's ordered great. a new 3.0 cable. Don was diagnosing that, and Ruby is clean. Yeah. We'll do the tire black tomorrow. And uh, Johnny's dropped off at Taekwondo, and blood drive, here we come. Pretty much. And then I got to pick up at Kohl's. I'm going to ask you to take me down there and um, drop me off at the door so I can go in and grab that. Okie dokie. Well, isn't that special, Donnie? We got another Tesla parked up there next to us. 
it's blue. Parking area. Yes, the Tesla Model Y parking area today. I got my pickup from Kohl's. The blood donation went fine for both of us, and um, we're on our way home via a few Pokestops.